I'm out on a patrol south of the Bartlett Cove area in Glacier Bay National Park, Alaska. It's a beautiful day up here. It's June 22nd, 2012, and this is a rare day where you see about 72 degrees Fahrenheit temperature. And as you can see, it's a very clear day. We're used to having a lot of days where the sun is not seen and it's very cloudy. The weather in southeast Alaska in this area, which is about 60 miles west of Juneau, is pretty similar to areas like Seattle and Portland, Oregon, uh, coastal areas in the northwest where you get a lot of rain. Now, as you can see in the distance, those are the Fairweather Mountains. And I'm just going to zoom in a little bit so you can get a little better view of those beautiful mountains. And the largest mountain or the tallest one is Mount Fairweather. Basically the U.S. Canadian border runs along the peaks of those mountains from what I've seen on the maps. So it was a logical dividing line. The border actually drops down very far into southeast Alaska, but once you see why they did it, um, you understand why it comes down so far. Again, it was because of the uh, the mountain peaks. Now as I move over here to the northeast I would say it is, you can see what we call the Bear Track Mountains. They're a lot darker. You can see that they're forested but they still have some snow in patchy areas and again remember this is now uh, June, June 22nd. Uh, there's a sailboat out there in uh, on the way into Bartlett Cove and I can zoom in a little bit and you can you can see the boat out there. And then again, I'll move slowly back around. That's Lester Island, by the way, in the background. And I'll just pan around again, and here comes the Fairweather Mountains into view. So, very beautiful scenery. It's a rare day. Today is 72 degrees. I'm from Florida, and this is typically the high temp in Florida during a winter day, say in December, January, February, March. And now I'll pan out again. I'm headed down south toward Point Gustavus, that way. So I just wanted to stop and make a little video though because of the, uh, the beauty of what I'm seeing right now. you an idea of what I'm experiencing right here. We're looking back toward the Bear Track Mountains and I can zoom in a little bit. I've just come around that point of land about an hour ago during this patrol. And as I move around and I'll zoom back out, you can get an idea of the beautiful scenery here. This is about a 72 degree day up here in southeast Alaska, which is pretty rare. As you can see, a lot of the mountains are visible. Some of those mountains are about 60 miles away, and we're able to see them from here. They're probably looking at Mount Fairweather, which is about 15,000 feet. We've got a beautiful day, a beautiful view here today. And as you can see, as I pan around, there's some more mountains. I'm heading down to that point right there. That's called Point Gustavus. So I'm just doing a little patrol out here to see what's happening, because this is uh, within the boundary of Glacier Bay National Park. We like to keep an eye on everything. We had a report, too, that there was some garbage possibly coming in from uh, the tsunami in Japan. It's taken about a year to reach Alaska and California, Washington, Oregon. But I guess they're starting to get reports of it now. So anyway, uh, it is a beautiful day up here. And uh, if you haven't seen Alaska, this would be a great place to come, especially in the summer. If you get a day like this, I would uh, definitely recommend it. 
Anyway, I'm going to continue my patrol, and uh, hope you have a great day.